Ami, the page girl. While talking to her, you'll learn that she wants people to read more books. And in order for her to jump out at you, you have to open the page that she is possessing in the book she is possessing. Her trait is Dumbing Book. Innate Paralysis and Shock Strike, 15%. Can always use Grimoire skills, dealing double damage to paralyzed or shocked foes. 50% chance to not consume a page when using Grimoire skills. And extra evasion and magic evasion. So all those are little bonuses that add up. The 50% chance not to consume the page is nice, because you don't run into a whole lot of those early on. So all in all... It's still nothing too special. We'll put it at C. For a play event, she reads a book. She gives you some food that she cooked. She falls asleep. She preaches about not smoking while reading. And she gives you a grimoire page. So, the sleeping is bad, but it bounces out with the Grimori page, which is better than just a normal item, because those are actually useful for skills. So it bounces out to a C. As for story interaction, she doesn't have a whole lot, so C. In the Pocket Castle, she interacts with Chandra. Keep that fire away from me. Be at ease. I'm the same as you. I'm also weak to fire. You're good at wielding fire, but you're all, but it's also your weakness. You have it rough. Does that make me dangerous? Not really. As for her presence, she surprisingly she's a vegan. She likes fruits and vegetables. She doesn't like sweets, bread, rice, or soup. Interesting reactions include... The chili pepper. I don't like spicy things. The bread. I'm not one to live off bread. The kid's meal. It's not something I should be eating. The Gian stew. I don't like soup, but there are problems before that. The baked potato. The baked potato, just put it in my belly. Beer. I can drink, but don't get drunk. Any of the grilled items. What is this? Any of the junk? A junk? You're not going to tell me to eat this, are you? Poison mushroom? <laughs> And last but not least, the Chi Papa. A spirit? How rare. Here, let's release you. Yoko, the book girl. While talking to her, you learn that she loves books and their writers. Her trait is multi arm bodyguard. Has 30% extra attack. Normal attacks act twice. Can always use unarmed and grimoire skills. 50% chance to not consume a page when using a grimoire skill. And grimoire skills use attack instead of magic. So, being able to use the attack bonus plus her extra 30% attack. 
That's a nice combination, especially since Grimori skills are very powerful for their level. Plus, she also has a chance to not use the page, which is always nice. So, that's quite a combination there. Nice synergy, we'll put it at B. Her play events are, she'll read a book, she gives a grimoire page, she gives food, she cooked it herself but is bad at cooking, she reads a dirty book and makes herself horny, and she throws a party, which no one attends because they're in the middle of battle. So, that's purely positive traits, so we have to put it at B. As for story interaction, she doesn't have much, so C. In the pocket castle, she interacts with Ani. Hello, page 17. Is there a book here that you would recommend? I would recommend a collection of Dr. Men's Earth Sciences Tristies, although that kind of book doesn't suit my taste. Don't you come across any good romance novels? I'm not really interested in that kind of thing, neither in fiction nor in reality. Jeez, what a cold hard page. As for her presence, she is a vegan, but she likes sweets, bread, rice, and soup, but she doesn't like vegetables or drinks. Interesting reactions include the chili pepper. This is not something you eat raw, right? Flour. Flour. I have no idea how to use it. Yaki soba bread. You put yaki soba noodles in between the bread? It's not very palatable. Connie Pod. Crab. Interesting bread. A sandwich. I'll eat a sandwich while reading. Inari Zushi. Inari Zushi? I feel like a fox. Kids meal. I'm not a child. But since you're already here... Hmm, <laughs> she does like it though. Key rice. I don't want to be treated like a pet. Gian Stew. This is... I feel malice. Odin. No potluck. The book will get covered in soup. Takoyaki. Takoyaki? I like it. Wedding cake? This is for a wedding? I'm so happy to get something like this. Honey? Honey, huh? It's vulgar to lick it out of the pot like this, but... Any of the grilled items? I don't need it. Cicada shell? Nature is wonderful, but I don't need it. Poison mushroom? <laughs> Last but not least, the Chi Papa. A little 
Spirit, huh? Shall I read you a picture book? Cornelia, the library girl. While talking to her, you learn that she hates fire and she wants to be fashionable. Her trait is Tentacle Dictionary. She can always use Grimoire, Demon Arts, and Tentacle skills. Grimoire skills deal 30% extra damage and boost all stats by 50% after use. 50% chance to not consume a page when using Grimoire skill. So a free all stat boost is rather nice. Combined with the extra damage from the Grimori skills, which already are powerful, so that makes a very nice com combination. We'll put it at B. For her play events, she reads a book, she gives a Grimori page, she gives food that she cooked herself. She throws a party that no one attends because they're on battle. And she plays with fire and gets burned. So, that's a positive combined with a negative. We'll put it at C. As for story interaction, she has a, a bit, quite a bit more than her other book companions. So we'll put her at B. In the pocket castle, she interacts with Promestein. My, Miss Scientist, I'm surprised that you almost never come to the library. Books are an inefficient path to gathering information. Reading is too time consuming. It's a huge waste of time. Isn't it fine for them to be a waste of time? Not everyone reads for the sake of gathering information. They do it for entertainment. It's fun to pass the time reading. I think reading is a nice distraction. Is it a bit like eating your heart to your heart's content without paying attention to calories? Well, something like that. Do you not care for dieting? I prefer everything to be closely managed. She also interacts with Minnie. Oh, it's Book Big Sis! Uh, stay away! I'm not good with fire! Read me a story, Big Sis! No! St stay over there! <laughs> she also interacts with Ani. Oh, page 17. Could you help me organize some books? All right. Jeez, page 97 has completely dried out in this book. And page 211 has showed up in this one. The loss of interest in books has become really serious. She also interacts with Yoko. Oh, miss page 65,537. Have you come across any good books lately? Actually, I have just recently acquired Lady Shirley's Lover. I'm so jealous. So, what do you think of it? Of course it's... <laughs> Make sure I get it next. <laughs> <laughs> Lady Shirley's Lover is, of course, an erotic novel disguised as an adventure book. For her presence, she is vegan. She likes fruits, vegetables, sweets, breads, rice, and soup. Interesting reactions include chili pepper. I'm not a fan of spicy food, to be honest. Tofu. It seems like these healthy meals are all the rage lately. Then fried tofu. I'm not a fan of oily food. Dried bonito. I'll sprinkle it over rice and eat it. 
Anko. Looking at it like this is so flippant. Well, no one is watching. Flower. Uncooked ingredients are difficult to handle. A sandwich. I can eat this while reading a book. A kid's meal. Do I look like a child? Vegetable stir fry. Vegetable stir fry. It's deliciously done. Miso soup. I'm concerned about the salt content. Gian stew. Is this poison? Odin. This food is kind of strange, but it's not bad. I like to invite all my page companions. Baked potato. A baked potato, huh? I actually love them. Chocolate. Chocolate. Yes, I'll eat it between reading. Wedding cake. The bigger the wedding cake, the faster the divorce. That's an interesting scene. Parfait. This is... Excuse me. Thank you. Coffee. Coffee, yes, I'll take it. Beer. I don't drink alcohol. Well, just a little. Honey. Licking it like this is a little... Let's do it while no one's watching. Any of the grilled items? I don't need this. Fish bones? This is not an appropriate gift. Poison mushroom? <laughs> Beetle? Do you think I eat bugs? And last but not least, the Chipapa. Isn't this an adorable spirit? Shall we let her go? Maria. The priest, BFR. You never fight her, so there are no talk events. Her trait is virtuous priestess. Can always use white magic, and white magic has two thirds the MP cost, which really amounts to not much. I mean, what, once you get a little bit far in the game, MP cost really is irrelevant. So we'll put that at D. Her play events are: she plays with matches, which deals damage to the enemy team. She gives you an item. She prays, which does nothing. She gets perverted thoughts, making her horny. And she prays, which activates a party heal. So that's actually four of five. That's actually so. That's actually a lot of positive effects. Unfortunately, none of the individual effects are very good but still they're all positive so B
As for story interactions, she has none, so F. I hate violence, but for the goddess, I will give it my all. 